I was brought up in Nigeria. I grew up in Nigeria until I was eight years old. Both my parents are Nigerian, and I was actually born in Lagos, Nigeria. So I'm very much, my, my, my earlier, earlier years were spent in Nigeria. I came to the UK, um, I started school in the UK, I went to boarding school. So that's when I started to get my Western influence and my understanding of the West. I've always been fascinated in, with, in fabrics, from the construction of the fabric to the surface design. Um, both come hand in hand. I started knitting from a really young age and actually I first of all got into fashion design but I found my main focus when I was designing clothes was actually the fabric. I'm so inspired by African prints because I'm a person that appreciates colour and what makes an African print to me it's its colour, not necessarily because it's bright or or vibrant, it's just the way the um, colours make the pattern. African fashion is almost like a mini model of Africa and the direction in which Africa could go. We have so many like global platforms like a rise showcasing in New York and Paris and London and that just shows that we are also moving with time. The future is really bright for African designers because now we have many people specializing in 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 the industry. We have we have people going to fashion school and learning the, the, the techniques properly which is something which has never really been done before because um, before in Africa it wasn't seen as proper to, to study the arts. We were more pushed to become doctors or lawyers, things like that. I'd love to see my designs in Bluebirds. I would love to see my designs also like on the high street eventually um, because obviously I want my brand to grow and I want people to be able to pick up Bank of Textiles quite easily. Keep true to your identity, keep your identity original and very prominent in your work and just keep pushing your ideas because it's a new idea and eventually people will start to understand it.